All right, let's continue. Who's, who's that? Isaac, listen oh. up. I've got over med side reports. These things are biorecombinators. They take dead tissue, absorb it, and mold it into new forms. One iteration seems to have the sole purpose of infecting corpses. The others, well, seem to be making corpses to infect. And that body tissue we keep seeing on the walls is part of it, too. I found a report that says it's a habitat changer. Um, I'm... I think she's talking about two different enemies. One you might want to stay away with because if you get too near it's basically an instant kill. I done that by accident uh, one time and basically my head went flying off. Um, the two enemies she's talking about, one we already know, those big bat things, they basically, I think that's what she's talking about, like what they turn into infected corpses and yeah, this is how bad things are getting. Uh, you can't die as far as I know. I wonder, is there anything out here? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Right, let's continue. If you're low on air after messing the room for, out there for some reason, just come in here and the air will restore. Plus, it's an upgrade bread, so that's always good. Right, let's see. I think I'll upgrade. Um, hmm. Let's see. I uh, screw it. I, 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 yeah, I know, I know. I'm wasting loads, but. Actually, since in the secret areas, like, you have to use the node to get in, I only have, like, a treasure that's only worth three grand and, uh, what was it? Three grand and a lot of ammo and credits. To be honest, I play through this game a lot and know what to do, so I won't need as much upgrades until, like, the final boss. Well, no, not upgrades uh, ammo and since when you're going to the final boss they basically throw a lot of ammo at you let's crash their party yeah basically these versions of the necromorphs are much more powerful so yeah, kill them faster than usual. Damn it, stay still. Uh, I'll be right back.